Hello, hello, I hope you're having a wonderful week. My name is Audrey, and welcome to Under the Waves. This is the last part of my three-part series. We should finish the game today, so let's dive right into it. Day 16. Always the alarm. Time to get out. I don't know why I'm sleeping in my wetsuit. God. I hope stopping those droughts made a difference. Let's let's well, from those things got into the ocean. Oh. Well, I hope it made a difference. Ah Mark really likes his rock music. What are we going to do today? Get daily tasks. Tasks are up at least. And uh, a message from Tim. Team moved for safety reasons. Relocated to emergency comm ship. Tasks huh. are normal. Fire is PR disaster. Clean up duties. Sorry, we'll contact soon. At so least he's, he's not available. Now I'm an errand boy for the Unitrend PR department. Coffee first. According to the Unitrend spokesman, the fire is well under control, and any wildlife impacted are being monitored by dedicated specialists. Indeed, from the shore here, there's little trace of any accident at all. The seas are calm, and everything seems ship-shape and above board. Back to you in the studio. Looks like the PR team are doing just fine without me. Impacted wildlife. Shit. I hope Joe's alright. That's horrible. There was a huge spill. Ah. Look for Joe. Oh. I hope he's okay. He's not there. Nothing. Eesh. Wait, he's tagged. I can track him from the main board. So I have to track down Joe. I hope he's fine. Too many tasks, too little time. Talk to employee relations about our sleepaway pilot program. Uh, can I have Joe's GPS signal, please? Where can I get it? Outside? Okay. Signal receiver. Okay. Maybe he tried to hide from the spill? Is he inside the facility? It's weird that he would go there. In here. Really? Huh. Training said this place was sealed years ago. Safety reasons. Off Why is he everyone. there? But if Joe's in there, that's where I'm going. How 
How can I open this? It seems... Yeah, it's sealed off. Okay, I'll take Moon. My trusty submarine. Look at this bad boy. Ooh. I don't need to take a picture, but <laughs> I want to. Let's see if this is a way in. State of this place. God knows what it's doing to the water. Deserted. Did they just up and leave? What's up there? <gasps> Can I maybe break the wall? I can. This, different than the others. this wasn't just abandoned. It was sealed. What were they trying to hide? And this is sealed off. Let's try and see. I'm gonna have to manually open the door, I think. Try not to bump into anything if I can. Eh. This is very narrow. Okay, let's go slowly. So narrow. Keep going. I don't think we're supposed to go there. Okay. This place is a maze. I'm gonna go here. I can barely see anything. This is... this is a bit claustrophobic. I'm so lost. I have no idea where I am. What is going on? Am I stuck in an algae? Okay. We can go this way. Or this way. I'll go this way. Jesus. What were they doing down here? Some mines? Shit. What is that supposed to be? What the hell is that? <gasps> oh go, my go, gosh! Go, go, go. Okay. 
Am I supposed to go in there? supposed to be uh, okay I don't see it we have to hurry is it there over here come on where shit no get away come on Come on, come on! Is there no end to this thing? A signal. Nothing. I have nothing. I see nothing. Got him. Ah, oh, he's there. Yeah. Okay. I'll stretch. I'm gonna try not to bump into anything. Where is he supposed to be? Right here, so... Okay, I'm gonna go... Without moon. Where is he? That's so sad. Ah, oh, that's so sad. Oh, Joe. That weird dream again. Garden set. That looks like our garden set. I remember there was music and balloons. Oh, my little girl is playing. <laughs> she almost fell. Henry pushed too hard and she toppled forward, like a nodding dog. I'm sorry I'm late, baby. I got caught up in... I had to... Daddy, Roger called me a name. Oh. A name? He said I was a, a dweeb. 
No. <laughs> Roger said that. Yeah. Well then, I guess I'll have to have a word with Roger. But look, I brought you something. A present? <laughs> a present. What is? <gasps> Happy birthday, sweetheart. This is Lumiere. Lumiere, this is Pearl. I want you two to take good care of each other. Okay? I promise. Thank you, Daddy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Bye, Joe. Joe, you were my only friend in the ocean. I'm gonna miss you. And I'm sorry for the pollution. Goodbye, Joe. I'll never forget you. that company because they're doing a lot of damage to the ocean. Oh. I think he's processing the death of his I daughter through maybe Joe. Yeah, let's call Emma. Calls with her are rough, but at least he's still trying. Come on, stupid. <sighs> Calm her down. Again. Again? Again. Well, what are you doing here? Come on, let's let's go for a walk. Oh. John Paul died, Pearl. Died? Yeah. We all... We all died. 
sweetie. No one ever wants their friends to die. But that's life. It's all a big circle. Circle? Yeah. Everything dies. And and when it does, it goes back into the earth and helps make new life. Even John Paul? Even John Paul. That's why it's important to remember them. The ones we lose. They're a part of that circle. And as long as we remember them, they're never really gone. I couldn't imagine explaining death to a child. Day 17. Save our souls. the radio alarm. Never find peace. SOS? Huh? Something on the board. SOS? Is someone calling for help? What's this? Looks like a distress call from Sector B. To Who mention could be some calling of the drones for help? sent over there, but this... This is coming in manually from a relief team alpha. Huh. Secure channel, no way to respond. Okay. Come on, Tim. Jesus. Starting to feel left behind here. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's have coffee. There's nothing much we can do. You're still talking about the fire? Such accidents were not uncommon on the platform before this week's disaster. Sea steward leader Fabio Martins has claimed there were several close calls in the past several months alone due to even trench cutbacks in both personnel and safety equipment. Is someone calling? <gasps> Tim! Stan, come in. Finally. I saw the news. Is there fire? Finally out. We, um, we took some casualties. We're getting you out of there. That's yes. why I'm calling. Okay. Finally. Okay. Yeah, that's probably a good... It is time. Yeah, okay. Boat with the retrieval capsules on its way. It'll take a day or two. Until then... One final job. Sector B. Sector B? The distress SOS. call. Checking. I haven't... There's no record of any distress call from Sector B. You didn't get it? Hmm. Coming through loud and clear here. On the Unitrench emergency frequency. Yeah. Odd. That's weird. Tim? I knew they were hiding something. So, what's the plan? Head over there. Check it out. And stay in radio contact. Something fishy is going on here. Oh no, something fishy. Setting out now. Okay. Last chance to stock up. This is gonna be a long one. Oh yeah? Well, I have more than enough oxygen sticks, but maybe I can craft something else. Maybe I can craft fuel and... Right. Let's see what I can craft. So we can see. Repair unit, I have two, so maybe another one. And fuel, we should be fine. Let's go. I'll take Moon.
Okay, girl. One last ride. What am I getting into here, Tim? During the storm, we had to evacuate the central administration bunker in Sector B, down at the base of the rig. Imagine a gray box full of filing cabinets, but with less personality. That's where your office was? Right. And you said... Some people didn't make it. Yes. Good people. I'm sorry. And now the signal. The SOS. If there's an SOS, I should have gotten it too. They're hiding something, Stan. The management. I know they are. A lot of sensitive material in that bunker. Records, reports. But as of yesterday, no personnel. So they say. So, to answer your question, we don't really know what you're getting into. Save that okay. it's probably not good. Okay. So they have their own agenda. It seems. There's a chest here. What is this? A snow globe. Ah. <laughs> Christmas, 1969. Where's all this coming from? <gasps> Orcas! Lovely shot. Gorgeous! Go to the surface. Woo! Wow! <laughs> oh, it feels weird. Okay, let's dive right back. Approaching the gate now. Should be just like the last time. Uh. Tim? Hello? Working on it? Yeah. <laughs> this is odd. It's asking for priority access codes. A secret I've base? I've heard of priority access codes. Let alone on the sector entrance. Give me a second here. In the meantime, there should be a secondary access around there somewhere. Really? Have a look around. Okay. A secondary access. So it's not this vent. There's another vent. Maybe here? through here. Okay. Very narrow, very narrow. If management is involved in this, there's no telling what I'll find in that signal. Nothing good. Where are we? And what am I gonna find? Who could be there? They would send another team and not tell anybody? So what's their agenda? So many questions! What is this? A kind of hole? Can I even go there? The... Wait. Okay, I'll open it manually, maybe. That's 
the other door. So I opened this. This looks like a full line. I'm being told access to Sector B is currently denied to anyone without a direct mandate from corporate. Oh, okay. Huh? Bad news. That's exactly where I am. Yeah. <laughs> a bit late understand. for that. There's nothing down there except the admin office and a storage bunker and, and the rig, of course. Are they worried some mad bastard might try and blow it up? People on the news seem pretty angry about the leak. Should I still be here? That bugger corporate bunch of assholes. I want to know what it is they're hiding down there. But they would send an SOS signal? Admin Center. Find out what that signal's all about, but stay safe. First sign of trouble, you leave. Head towards that. Okay. Diving capsule. Very bizarre. Let's check it out. We have a diving capsule with We've got weird a capsule things. Here, Tim. And empty. Looks like a rescue team. All right. Huh. But if everyone was evacuated, a rescue team for who? Or what? Yeah. Still no details on this end. If they sent a team, they did it outside of normal procedure. There's a black hole where any briefing files would be. Main door's locked. From the inside. Huh. That's not... normal. I don't... Why? Why would a relief team lock themselves inside an evacuation zone? So, find another entrance. Okay. There's nothing here. There's an industrial center here. Maybe through there? This should get me in. That's good. Or very, very bad. What's going on? What is going on? This is oil. Refined. Why is this here? There's a small storage bunker right by the admin center. God knows why, but that's where you are. Huh. Oh, we're gonna blow up the door? Okay. Subtle, but it did the job. Probably won't be the last door you'll have to bust down. Corporate can build me. This is a crafting station? Ah. Useful? But I'm I think I'm fine. Okay. The water doesn't seem healthy. Hmm. 
It seems deserted. I think I should take a flare. Back. Get back. What is this place? Processing oil. If you want something done right. Let's follow the little barrels. To do with those leech things I saw. That special oil. Possibly. I asked around, covertly. No one's ever heard of anything like that. Or any special oil. Admin center proper now. Okay. Home sweet home. Unit the trench. Is coming from somewhere in that area. Check around. Killers are circling. Killers? Try not to take that as an omen. Go there. Let's take some mines just in case. Oh, no. What? I'm at some sort of locker room. It it's completely submerged. to see because it's so narrow this is not normal that it'd be submerged so I don't know what happened It's locked. Hmm. How 
not sure where I have to go, but I think I'm going in the right direction. This stuff is everywhere. Don't tell me there's been a leak. No, this isn't oil. This... I saw it in the drone bunker. Some sort of invasive sea life? Leeches or something? It's weird. Again with the leeches. It's oil, trust me. When it hits water that deep, it floats in these big globs. Very leech-like. Dave, huh. whatever I'm seeing, it's not oil. Why would I need to stock up like that? What's gonna happen? <sighs> it looks like fish, though. My side. Returning to normal. Okay, I opened the door. Signals coming from the server room. There's an entrance here. Looks like the server room. Oh god. <gasps> uh oh. Is that Tim? Found one of the team. Can't be sure, but he looks dead. Did he get locked inside? Doors locked? Of course. You need to get in there. Find out what happened. Head to the control room upstairs. See if we can't end this bloody lockdown. First, though, give me a scan of those servers. Might be able to grab some info. I need a battery. Tim, this wasn't a relief mission. This was a search and destroy. What? The team. They were sent down here to wipe the servers, the records, huh. everything. They initiated the evacuation. They flooded the place. We were never in any danger. They just wanted us out of the way so they could clean up their dirty laundry. Oh. Oh, shit. Hmm. Now what? No budging this. I need a battery. <sighs> Damn it. Locked, Locked. again? battery. Perfect. Well, I did something. But it didn't open this door. This is getting... It's still locked down, Tim. Gotta find another way in. It opened okay. this one. Right. I think. Maybe... Maybe through the living quarters. There's another entrance. On my way. Jesus Christ. You know, I just realized I missed that place. What did I find, though? Huh. 
Canteen. Looks like everyone left in a hurry. These look like the crew cabins. Emergency access to the control room should be through here. I think I found your cabin. Anything salvageable? Found a picture. The one of me and the ex-wife? I can stay. How long were you down here? Lost count. A couple of years. Through there, maybe? Ah! At last. Look for the command control board. That'll get you into the server room. Timothy Graham. When Unitrench first came, Tim was furious. This was back before anything was set. When the council were considering options and looking into the situation. Even that set him off. Who are these people, this corporation, to come into his waters? It only got worse from there. After Dad died, he became single-minded. His anger was unbound. Almost got himself arrested a few times. Hit someone once from the company. And then he was working for them. It took them years, but they won him over. He never said how, money I assume. We talked less after that, until I joined him. Until I joined Unitrench. Hmm, interesting. Open access to server room, okay. <gasps> what is this? What is this? A whale shark? I think it's a whale shark. It's beautiful. Done. The lockdown's lifted. Head back to the server room. Let's get this over with. Sitting in. Can I see who it is? <sighs> Jeez. Oh. Got it. Okay, looks like the process they've started is still running. Damn all this technical mumble jumbo. Bugger it. The thing's all have an off switch. Shut them all down. Pull the plug. One down. Nearly there. One more. And done. Up yours, you corporate. Oh no. Oh. Tim? Hello? Anyone? Oh, I'd be so scared. In the dark? Ah, uh, supermarket. I don't understand. Ah, oh, that little octopus again. Oh. Let's follow it. Pearl is here. I know it. Ooh. I have to find her. This is making me dizzy for some reason. Oh, found her. Is that you. I found her. Hello, Pearl. Sweetheart. What are you doing here? I'm waiting for mom, Sally. I think you made her sad. What were you fighting about? 
we weren't fighting. We talked about them. But that fight, hey, <laughs> the fight was no big deal, you know? Everything was, everything's fine. Say goodbye. Hmm. He doesn't want to say goodbye. He's not ready. It's appearing to thin air, there, lad. You back with us? I'm out, Tim. I'm done. I saw the data erasure has stopped, and <gasps> no. I mean, I'm done. With this. All of this. Okay, lad, I, um... Yeah. That's probably for the best. I'll schedule a retrieval crew ASAP. You get yourself back to the launch. Let's get out of here. So, where's Moon? Wow. Oh, it's so cute. I love sharks. I really do. Um, where to find my submarine? I need to tell you something. All right. It's about Pearl. <sighs> She followed me here. Some part of her. Not sure I understand. Neither do I. I've seen things down here. I had no idea what possible. Stan. I'm gonna need the fuel. Phoenix. Did they ever come back? What? No. No, I'm fine. Oh wait, you, you think this is narcosis? That I dreamt up a thing that nearly killed me. No, no, I believe you. This is a lot. I know. We'll talk more when I get up there. But there's something very wrong down here, Tim. Okay, lad. Whatever it is, we'll see it sorted together. So I don't have fuel anymore, so I'll try to find fuel because. Closer than we thought. They'll be on station this? tomorrow morning. There'll be a capsule waiting. And, um, comms are back up at the module. I know. I know you came down here to get away, but, um, with all the shit that's happened. I know, Tim. It's. it's okay.
Okay, I think it was a humpback whale. So I need to find a blue whale. I hope my submarine's gonna respawn because it's far. I guess this is it. Last night under the waves. Last night? Okay. Just gonna craft. Let's Just get gonna cooking. craft a bit. Need to call out. What did I find? It's been too I long found already. something. A solar upgrade. Ah Yes, I'm gonna craft this. Okay, gonna call Emma. I hope it's gonna go well because these conversations with her are tense. Which is understandable after what they went through, but still. It's difficult to listen to sometimes. She's worried. Stan, can you hear me? <laughs> I'm here. I'm... I'm here. I saw the rig on the news. Worst platform accident in over a decade, they said. The environmental damage alone... And I can't even worry about that because my husband refuses to listen to reason. I'm coming back. All the chase some flight... What? She's surprised. I'm done. Yeah. It's all... Done. I'm coming home. Tim's sending a Good for him. Tomorrow. Uh, I'm that's She must be relieved. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Um why am I not why do I feel there's a but? I just I can't leave her like this. I think she needs my help. Pearl. Yes. He means to say... He needs to say goodbye. What does she say? I don't expect you to... Understand. Understand? What is there to understand when you're not making any sense? I'm pregnant! Whoa. What? <laughs> I'm... I'm pregnant, Stan. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my... <laughs> We're gonna have a... A baby. <laughs> We're gonna have a baby. <laughs> Can he even process that at this point? Seems like a lot. Oh my god. I... I can't. Yeah. Alright, look, I... I know I haven't been, in a, in, a, in a way I've just been, I, I, I just miss her so much, Emma. Every time I close my eyes, I see her, I, I see you, I see us, and it, and it never stops hurting. And you think it's been different for me? I haven't had a single waking moment of clarity in three years. But I... I knew I couldn't let that pain define me or I would never, ever escape it. I love you. But starting again, moving on, it is hard, Stan. I'm gonna need you with me. Of course they need each other. I will be. I promise. You okay. do whatever it is you need to do. Okay. But God That's help good. Me, if you leave us, I will never forgive you. She has a harsh way of speaking to him, but they're Baby. both going through grief differently, Baby. I feel. How can I possibly... You've got to get over yourself. One 
once and for all. For them. <laughs> hmm. A baby. That's a lot. That's a lot. Tempting, but no. No? Oh, I have to call Tim? Okay. Last check-in. You'll pick up a ride around sunrise tomorrow and... Emma's pregnant. What? <gasps> yeah. Bugger me. Well, congratulations. How are you? <laughs> How are you sitting with it? Yeah. Ah, uh, still... Processing. Ah, it's exactly what you need. It'll be perfect, I'm telling you. Hmm. What about you? What happens now? That is a little more complicated. You know, maybe I'll go back to the boats. There's still a few decent crews out there. As for the data Unitrends tried to erase, well, you know how clumsy I can be. I'm <laughs> telling whose mailbox it led up in. Really? Good for them. I'll look forward to watching the fallout from a distance. Talk to you tomorrow. In person, this time. Hmm. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Ah. Sleep well, Stan. Good for them. So they're both getting out of this company. It feels wrong, all of it. Rest. I need. Rest. Is this Joe? What is this? Oh no, okay. I thought this was the ghost of Joe. <laughs> no. No. It's a jellyfish. Wait. Huh. Hello? <gasps> okay, he needs to deal with this. Come on, Stan. You can do it. I can't get to sleep. I may as well be awake. Oh. Does he want me to follow or something? Looks like I'm dreaming though. Look at the glow. Wait. Come back. That's you. Isn't it? You want me to follow? Outside? Imagine if he's sleepwalking and then goes for a swim. Is that even possible? That's a scary thought. What is 
that? Is this a dream? Sleeping though. I think this is a dream. Oh, no. no, no, no. Well, this is. This is bad. Yeah. <laughs> this is bad. Okay. Yeah, pretty much. Stay calm. Deep breaths. Conserve oxygen. This is narrow. What is this? A statue? This is so bizarre. Holy shit. Yeah. What, what the that? a hand? Are those eyes forward? <gasps> eyes forward. No. Oh, uh, should I? This is so weird. Oh, fuck. Oh god. Whales. A whale graveyard. An entire ecosystem. Oh wow. Centered on a single oh. being. <laughs> Even in death, Emma, Emma told me, their bodies, what, <gasps> what is this place? This is so weird. <sighs> what? <laughs> Music is way too happy. Our house. How did I? Pearl. You. You're still here. Well, he found her. Okay, you. I think you've about worn out that armchair. Let's get out of here. Uh, when did you get so big, huh? Up the wooden hill to Bedfordshire. Here we go. Daddy, I had a good day. Oh. There we go. Package delivery. One sleepy girl. Better? Mm, better. It's cold. Let me close the window. This is such nice symbolism. Under the covers now. Okay, Daddy. There you are. Been on quite the journey together, eh? 
Thanks for the ride. Found him. Think he was making a break for it. Maybe he was trying to find you, so you could tell us a story? Okay. <laughs> okay, what'll it be? The whale song. All right, love. All right. Settle down. The whale song. Ah. Once upon a time, there was a baby whale. A cute calf, roughly three tons from head to tail. Standard weight. His mother was a different beast entirely. Over 30 meters long and 70 tons of love so motherly. Wow. The whale calf, not even close to her, worried without delay. Mummy, when you are gone, what will I become? Its mother would gently say, I will always be close to you. It was not a terrible lie to start, because our dead keep on living here, in our heart. But it wasn't fair for the baby whale, who had seen his father died from a harpoon's travail. He asked again, So where has Papa gone? His mother took a deep breath and replied, heads on, he is still here. His soul is swimming next to us, far and near. Then she added, I will bring you to a place without lies, a place without pretty sights. Always remember this, and you will move on. On the beach, where many corpses lie, Whales in decomposition, skin dry. Ooh, this is taking a turn. balls of plastic for pillows. The calf's eyes got wet, and before long, tears flowed. Warm and clear. His heart heavy, he started a song. Sorrowful and sincere from the baby's ache out of the waves a miracle happened the air started to vibrate the ground to shake one of the still bodies rose and widened despite the waste and the rubbish against the fragile cycle Death was ascending to the sky, across eternity's threshold. Then death would fall down to feed the earth, continuing a never-ending cycle in which we always find a morrow. Okay, love. Time for bed. Oh, Daddy, please. It's it's so cold down here. And lonely. Stay. Please. Oh, God. Sweetheart. I don't know if I can. <sighs> Could I really stay? Emma. Baby. <laughs> Pearl's here. She's... She's right here. <sighs> I can't just leave. Can I? Should I? Emma needs me. I... need her. 
No. I have to stay. I won't lose my daughter. Not again. So you can leave or stay with her? Oh, wow. Hmm. Stan, it is time. It is time for you to leave. And it's difficult, I know, and you love her. But Emma needs you as well. And your new little baby. I... I'm sorry, sweetheart. I've... Mommy needs me. We're having a... We need each other. Yeah. I Aww. miss you. I'll always miss you. Always. Did he really go for a swim while he was sleeping? So we're out. was going to throw the picture in the in the ocean. Oh, uh, good man. Good man, Stan. died three years ago wow. seems like hardly any time at all and an eternity I thought it was more recent it was her love that hurt most it's absence like when she'd jump onto our bed on Saturday mornings when Emma sneak up behind her lift her overhead the house was empty without it but I still hear it every single day it's mine now and I guess that's the point life is one long series of partings hmm. but no one ever really leaves we move on knowing we carry them with us Pearl is with me now. I will love her for as long as I love anything. But for the first time in a long time, I feel... unburdened. Free. Like I don't have to run from the future. I have to let her go. But I'll never leave her behind. Oh, well said. Because none of us are alone. Not really. Oh. I love you. Ah! Oh, what a 
beautiful game. Beautiful story. Much more sad than I thought, though. But beautiful. I liked it. I really did. The music, the atmosphere, the calmness of the ocean. I really liked it. Wow. Well, I hope you enjoyed it too. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.